it's me, and I am here with the Sephora Mini Haul. I have never been to the mall as much as I've been to the mall in the last three weeks or so. I always, always, always go to Sephora on my birthday because they give, they, all, they every year they give a great birthday gift, and they were out of the Marc Jacobs Eye and Lip duo. Um, there was an, an eyeliner and a nice red lipstick. And I'm like, oh, I need that in my life. So I was looking forward to going on my birthday, but then I was sick for like a week <laughs> around my birthday. Um, when I got well enough, I went and they no longer ha had that item. Like it's supposed to be for the whole year. They have the same thing, but in December, December baby here, they ran out. Uh, and all they had was like some skincare thing from fresh and I'm like I have a strict skincare regimen I can't I, I I'm not gonna switch up my skincare so um, I checked back I checked back they said we're not getting in more anymore in we'll have the new gift birthday gift in January so what I did was I called Sephora and I said hey look this is what's happening and they said oh no problem at all um, we'll extend your birthday gift through January. So just pop in on January and you can pick up the new item. So that's what I did. <laughs> um, but, uh, but until that, I kept checking back. Plus a friend of mine gave me a gift card. To oh! Wait, I wasn't supposed to say the department store name. A friend of mine gave me a gift card for my birthday to a major department store. And I, you know, I never, thought of myself as cheap <laughs> not even necessarily frugal i just don't like to pay inflated prices for something when i know i can get it get it cheaper like i just I, it bothers me so so i kept going back to this store um i actually went to two different uh it's a chain nationwide chain and i went to two different uh, stores. I'm trying not to say the, the name of the store. Trying to figure out, okay, what am I going to spend my $50 on? How can I get the most bang for my buck? I actually recorded uh, a video and I just I just need to edit it. Um, I had planned to get it up before, before the holidays were over, but I think you'll enjoy it anyway. But today is about my mini Sephora haul. So here we go. They have the cutest bags. I don't know if this is for just for the new year or what. Look at that. It's, it's all sparkly. Look at the back of it. Like just looking at the bag makes me happy. It's in bar relief. It's bumpy. <laughs> you know, like you can you can feel the feel the the gemstones. It's the little things. Okay. One thing I don't like about this bag is they skimped on handles. So if all your if your if this bag is heavy on one side, it tilts to that side. So when I was walking around the mall, it kept shifting like this, and I was scared my stuff was gonna fall out. So I need Sephora to do better on that. But it's really cute. Not not exactly functional though. So I went into Sephora, and um, I'm gonna show you the birthday gift first since I I talked it up. They have two birthday gifts. One is from Cauda Lee, and it's it's skincare. Um, it's a sorbet for your skin, moisturizing sorbet. I already have that as a sample, and something else. But I was like, I don't want that. I want this right here. It's hard to see. I I made myself a ring light. <laughs> And now I just need to figure out how to keep it from reflecting on the product. All right, so look. Well, it looks it looks <laughs> looks uh, looks like it's got Christmas lights on it. So here we go. It's the birthday gift. Happy birthday, Tartelette. So it's by Tarte, and it's a blush and um, cream lipstick duo. Yeah. So. I'm very happy to get my birthday gift. I'm all about getting my birthday gifts. Now, I had just run out of my uh, Holy Grail foundation, and that is this. 
I've talked about it before. I love this stuff. It's Hourglass Immaculate Foundation. It's a liquid powder. It's uh, mattifying, oil-free. I put it on my skin like, it, and it keeps me matte. And it doesn't rub off on stuff. This is the best foundation that I have ever, ever, ever used in my life. As a matter of fact, um, I knew I was running out of it and I used another foundation that I that I had in the cabinet that I didn't use all up and I'm like oh, you know, okay I used this before it didn't kill me you know my face itched all day yesterday thankfully I didn't break out but yeah my face doesn't like that kind of change it was like girl what you doing up in here we got you know you done got us together and now you're doing all this stuff to us so this is my my holy grail. This is if you have if you have oily skin. I used to have just totally oily skin. Now I am oily here, and um, and then here is I have rosacea. So this area is what's affected by my rosacea. So it's it's really dry and it's it gets sensitive. This is great for oily skin, but if you just put I, I use moisturizer here every day here and under here and uh this works great it's the best stuff i've ever used their shades for brown skin are limited and the website was sold out i'm giving you the side eye for that sephora fix that um but since i subscribed to sephora play i was able to take my my little card that i showed you in my sephora play review and I got 50 extra points. You know, I like those beauty insider points. So I got some more free stuff because I had uh, enough beauty insider points to pick out some, some free gifts. I bank my points. And when I see something that I really like, I'm like, yeah, let me cash in some of those points. So one of the things that I cashed in points for was this lipstick just because I like the color of it and I'm gonna take it out and show it to you. Okay, it's Vice um, by Urban Decay Lipstick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I'm gonna show you this color. And I'm gonna keep it, oh, the color is Venom. Comes in a cute little, little packaging. You see that? Urban Decay, shiny. It looks like a like a bullet that isn't rounded at the top. <laughs> it's like a a deep like a purple. <laughs> okay, <laughs> in the light it looks like what I have on right now. A deep purple. And I was like, yes, I'll take one of those, please. And I also took the Bumble and Bumble BB Repair. It's a blow dry uh, repair serum. And I figured why not, you know? I, I showed you where I, I have those uh, like stringy straight ends from flat ironing my hair. You know, I don't I don't actually blow dry my hair very often. Uh, I'm more likely to diffuse if I'm going to wear my hair out and curly. But since I have those little stringy ends that I'm really I've been trimming them and um, I may just cut them off all together. And, and I don't know. I don't know. I haven't figured that part out yet. <laughs> it irritates me to look at them like if I have my hair in a ponytail, and I got those little straggly ends hanging down. Um, but they're not, they're no split ends. Like they're, they're not, you know, they're, they're healthy. The curl pattern is just gone bye-bye because I, uh, because I flat ironed it, but I will flat iron my hair again. So I'm like, eh, might as well just leave the ends there. Plus, you know, I don't wear my, my hair. I don't wear it down at all. Cause it's just, it's too much at this point. It's, just, it's, it's too much for me, but I will wear a ponytail sometimes and, and it looks a little anemic these days. Uh, so yeah, I figure why not? All right. So I got those free just because I, I buy stuff at Sephora and I get points. They put some samples in my bag. One is, what is this? Belief. 
spelled incorrectly <laughs> with a very creative spelling. The True Cream Aqua Bomb. Who, who makes this? Napiers. All right, I'll show you what it, that's, that's what the little package looks like. What's it for? Oh, it's supposed to increase your hydration level up to 18%. Our belief is to deliver instant moisture, blah, 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 blah. Oh, well, you might want to hear that. With Ladies Mantle, a hydrating herb. This refreshing gel cream provides weightless yet long-lasting hydration. All right, I, I won't use this. I won't use that. And Hello Fab. This sounds like benefit. Who made this? Hello, Hello Fab, coconut skin. Oh, no, no, no. <clears throat> My skin doesn't like coconut. It it looks great, but it itches till I just wanna wanna scratch myself raw. Coconut skin smoothie priming moisturizer. Safe for sensitive skin. Not this sensitive skin, baby. Fab first aid beauty. Oh, okay. So there's a brand called Fab. I've never heard of them, but here, look, I'll show it to you, and and maybe it's something that that you need and that you can use. So those are two samples that I will not use, but it's nice to get free stuff. You know, somebody can use them. And Sephora gave me, Sephora is like drug pushers. They give you some of these samples and they get you hooked on stuff and then you go and buy it later. Well, they gave me a sample like a couple, two, three months ago, gave me a sample of a fragrance called Maison Margiela, um, Replica Fun Fair Evening. There are a bunch of scents in the Replica line, and they're really they're designed to evoke a certain a sense of a certain place. Um, there's one called Jazz Club. It's supposed to be like a j jazz club in Chicago. Um, there's one called Lipstick. There's one, yeah, you know, there are a bunch of them. Well, they gave out Fun Fair Evening and I fell in love with it instantly. Like I used that little vial up in no time flat. And then I went back to the store looking for, uh, you know, a, a roller ball or something like that, that I could use. Something that wasn't gonna cost me an arm and a leg, but that I could have the fragrance. Cause I don't wear fragrance every day. Not only did they not have it in the store, but when I looked on the website, um, all they had was the bottle that cost one hundred twenty-five dollars, and I, I'm I'm not a <laughs> maybe I am cheap. <laughs> I'm like I'm not about that life. <laughs> so I'm like, no, I need where's the the eighteen to twenty dollar roller ball <laughs> that I can just roll on every now and then because it, honestly, I have have a few perfumes and uh, sometimes they go bad before I can use them up. Like if I don't need a, a huge bottle of perfume. I'm not gonna use it every day. So every time I would go in the store, I would go and look and, and I didn't even see the bottle. Like they just didn't have it. So yesterday I asked the cashier, I said, look, I said, I've been looking for this uh, fun fair evening scent since you gave me a sample months ago, I love it. What happened to it? And she's like, um, I don't know. And one of the other, I think she was a manager, overheard it. And she said, oh, you're in luck. She said, I just inventoried the whole store and I found a bottle. And we only have one bottle, so I can give you a sample. I was like, hey, you speaking my language. So, so she gave me a sample of it. And uh, I, love, I love the way this smells. Maison Margiela Replica Fun Fair Evening. And it's in a little Sephora vial. It's got a spray top. And this will get me by for a while. I'm very happy with this. Uh, she said that they don't know when they're going to get more in. So I don't know. But unless it's a rollerball or it's a smaller size uh, bottle. I'm not getting it because I'm not paying $125 for a bottle of perfume. Well, that is my haul. I bought one thing that I was going to have to buy anyway, and I got a bunch of stuff. <laughs> it made me really happy. I like free. Okay, short and sweet. I will see you again very, very soon. Bye.